And I'm Brittany Wiley, and this is Wolfpack News for Tuesday, February 9th, 2016. The Tim Tebow Foundation is holding a Night to Shine special needs prom on Friday from 6 to 9 p.m. at East. If you're interested in getting some community service hours or attending the event, you can sign up at their website, www.specialprom.com. What do Scottish Castles, Oxford University, and London all have in common? These are three amazing historical sites that we'll be exploring during the 2017 summer trip with Mrs. Nelson and Miss McCoy. And there is a parent informational meeting next Thursday at 6 p.m. in the community room. Contact Mrs. Nelson with any questions. Valentine's Day is coming up, and what better way to celebrate than by giving a friend a Valentine's Day? Here's more on how you can do that. 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 Sophomores and juniors, applications for freshmen Sophomore seminar juniors, leadership positions are now open. This is a great leadership opportunity and you can earn 50 community service hours. It takes place if you're graduate study and you will work with the incoming freshman classes in their adjustment, in adjustment to high school. Applications can be completed online and are due by Friday. See Mr. Idrin in F132 with any questions. East TV is selling birthday grams. Here's a look at what they are and how you can wish anyone here at East Day happy birthday. There's a mandatory World Cup meeting on Thursday There's after school in the community room. The new senior shirts are available with the, the class of 2016 names on the back for $15. Order forms are available in student services or at the senior celebration shop at the table during lunch. Order your keepsake shirt by Friday. The Black Student Association is throwing a potluck at 6.30 on Thursday. They will have special features by our very own students and guest speakers. Food will be provided and there will be no cost to the event. You would love for you, for you and your family to come celebrate Black History Month with us. This event will be held in the community room. If you want to earn a free ticket to prom, senior brunch, and senior celebration, help sell Miss Fields cookies and more, and earn your ticket. Take orders now and apply funds when you attend these events. Order forms and guidelines can be picked up from student services or the senior celebration table during lunch. Orders with payment. Or do no later than Thursday. There's a bass fishing meeting after school today in G325. Any questions? See Coach Broken. Mandarin Club is having a Panda Express fundraiser on Friday. 20% of your purchases on that day will go towards Mandarin Club. Pick up a Mandarin Club flyer from J103 to bring with your purchase. The Panda Express is located here in Oswego on Douglas Road. And now it's time for entertainment. Here's Alan. And now it's time for entertainment. Here's Alan. East Theater is starting a new tradition East this Theater year with their production of Senior Scenes. Seven seniors of East Theater are directing their own scenes and musical numbers in a cabaret-style performance this Thursday at 7 p.m. in the Performing Arts Center. Admission is free and seating is on the stage. Come support East Theater seniors. 
Congratulations to their East Beach team for their performance at the regional tournament on Saturday. As a team, they took fifth and are advancing to several individuals, uh, advancing several individuals to the sectional tournament this weekend. Caroline Byrne and Peyton Johnson advance in HGA. Miranda Johnson in poetry, Ali Filichikia in original oratory, and Peyton Johnson in humorous interpretation. In addition, East performance of the in performance in the round of the Breakfast Club took second place and will also advance to sectionals. The cast is compromised of Mitchell Crispy, Francis McDonald, Hunter Stone, Jasmine McCombe, Jalen McDonald, and Ali Garudo. Congratulations, speeches. That's all for entertainment. Now back to the anchor desk. Thanks, Ali. The OE Film Fest has extended their due date for films to be submitted. All films and paperwork must be submitted by next Monday. We must get at least three entries to run the festival. Check out our website for forms and more info. OEFilmFest.Weebly.com or email Mrs. Allen. The next talk will take place on Thursday, February 25th. Please pick up a permission slip in student services if you're interested in attending. An introductory film club meeting will be held at 5.30. They may be last more than an hour. Future meetings will run longer based upon the selected film of the month. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Query. Students, do you have questions about the SAT? Mr. Savage is inviting you to join him in the PAC on Thursday during your guided study class for answers to your questions. There will be another presentation for you and your parents on Wednesday, February 18th at 6 p.m. in the PAC. And now it's time for sports. And Here's Allie. The girls' bowling team looks to win their sixth the sectional championship in 10 years this weekend at Elmar Bowl in Bridgeview after finishing second to a Bonzi Rally this past weekend at Regionals. Senior Abby Ragsdale was the individual champion with a nice 1,405 series. Good luck, Lady Wolves. To ladies interested in badminton, the season is right around the corner with tryouts beginning on February 29th. Any questions, see Coach Jerkovic. And there's a mandatory meeting for all girls trying out for girls' soccer. Please attend one of the following meetings. This Thursday at 2.30 p.m. or Friday at 7 a.m. in room G239. Information will be communicated about the tryout paperwork and schedules. If you have any questions, please see Coach Morganay, Coach Killiam, Coach Leal, or Coach Kelleher. There is also an open gym this Thursday from 6 to 7 a.m. in the Blue Gym. That's all for sports. Now back to the anchor desk. That's all for sports. Now back to the anchor desk. Thanks again, Allie. That's today's edition of Wolfpack News. I'm Alexa Shekel. And I'm Brittany Wally. Join us again tomorrow on East TV. Don't forget to stop by our Twitter at Oswego East TV for daily updates. Thanks for stopping by, Wolves, and have a great day. Wolves rock. Have a great day. Wolves rock. Have a great day. Wolves rock.